transition from the district now and into a bizarre murder case. Albert Muth will likely spend the rest of his life in prison after killing his socialite wife. D.C. Bureau Chief Sam Ford is live outside D.C. Superior Court now with all the sentencing details. Judge Russell Kanan said evidence against Muth was overwhelming, and yet the 50-year-old man who the judge said tortured his 91-year-old wife to death showed nothing. No remorse, the judge said. No acceptance of responsibility, so there were no mitigating circumstances. 50 years for the man who walked the streets of Georgetown in an Iraqi general's uniform, who starved himself down to 130 pounds, trying to avoid the trial for the death of his wife, 91-year-old Viola Draft. They were married more than 20 years. Muth watched the proceedings from a hospital room at United Medical Center in Southeast, where he had also watched the trial, responding when the judge asked him questions. Prosecutor Glenn Kirshner had asked for life without the possibility of release, but seemed satisfied with the 50-year sentence. Uh, Mr. Muth is 50 now, and this will bring to an end um, a nearly three-year-long case. Um, and it will put an end to his career as a con man, uh, a fraud, and most importantly will give the uh, draft family some peace of mind, some closure that um, there was at least some justice for the, the murder of Viola at the end of the day. The judge noted all the personas of Ruth, of, of Muth, from an Iraqi general to a religious zealot, and said Muth was nothing more than a common serial abuser made worse when he drank. Reporting live from D.C. Superior Court, Sam Ford, ABC 7 News.